Alright, hey guys, this is going to be a real quick tutorial on how to get Pokemon Black or White working for the No Cash GBA. Now, it's pretty simple. You just have to take this code here if you have black, or this code here if you have white, and you're going to open No GBA. Now, you're going to notice that you get this message. Just go to Utility, Cheats and add new. I already put in the code so I'm not going to do that, that's what this is. And then you're going to click on raw action replay DS and then you're going to click OK. Then you're going to do this and check it. You have to do this every time that you start no cash GBA. Then you do OK reset cartridge. Now it's going to start up fine but when you try and make a new game it's going to just black screen on you. So what you're going to do is close that and go to the INI file right here and open that up. Now there's three values that you have to change in here which are right here. Now it's easiest if you just do control F if you didn't already know that and then try and find something that's said in here. So like reset slash startup entry point. Just do control F reset. And if I can't find it just do up. See here it is right here. You didn't really have to search for that but the rest of them it's it's just easier. It's more convenient. And you're gonna change the value here. I already have mine changed so yeah. You're gonna change that to that and then you're gonna do this then change that right here to this right here. I'm going to post this all in the description. And after you change all those INI files, you should be good to go. And everything should run like it's supposed to. Again, you have to do this every time you start it up an inconvenience, but hey, you play for free, so quit whining. <laughs> and there it is. Or just go to new game, whatever, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Why am I trying to click on that? And it should load up just fine. Hope I help some people. And yeah. See ya.